Did you know that you can use ClickUp on your Apple Watch? Your Apple Watch? I'm not doing a very good job of showing this. It's not really meant for like a show and tell kind of face. So we're gonna look at that. We're gonna look at how to load it onto your Apple Watch, how to get notifications, how what you can and can't do on there, and if it's even worth having. The first thing you're going to do is open up the App Store on your iPhone and you're gonna search for ClickUp. Now make sure ClickUp is installed. I already have it on my iPhone, so it's all automatically going to store the option for your Apple Watch. So the next thing you wanna do is just go all the way to the right, and then when you see App Library, just go ahead and find your watch, open that up. And now when you go down here, you're going to see um, installed on the Apple Watch. I already have ClickUp. Just go ahead, hit that arrow, make sure that this is toggled on to show the app on your Apple Watch, otherwise you're not going to be able to find it. And if you don't see it there for any reason, you can go over here where it says available apps and you can install it just like I did there two seconds ago. Um, and that will make sure 100% that it is there on your Apple Watch when you go over to it. So the next thing you might wanna do is sync your Apple Watch. So now we're gonna switch over to our Apple Watch. And if you just hit the little dial on the right, um, you could have a list view. I chose to have just a bunch of icons, which means, of course, anytime you add a new app, you might have to do a little bit of hunting around to find the one that you need. Luckily, there aren't a lot of apps that are available for the Apple Watch, so we found the ClickUp one pretty easily. All right, so now it's gonna ask me to log into ClickUp on my iPhone, which I have already done. So now I can see all of my tasks for the day. So I'm gonna see September 21. Um, Google Slides, uh, book summary, create slides, and record video to post to Circle. I do have to do that uh, for book club every month. So it looks like I only have two tasks for today, uh, module five CSS techniques. That's a course that I'm taking. I am super behind. I actually haven't even done that. Um, and then over here at the left, I can look over at overdue tasks, which there are a lot. <laughs> As you can see, I, I'm not really that behind. I just have not taken the time to go into ClickUp and actually update it like I'm supposed to. Um, but let's just take one of these that I've already done, probably towards the top, the most recent ones, um, and that would be Xtiles video. I already did that. Um, so I know what you're thinking, how do I check this off? I don't think you can. I think this is just for you to look at. It's more of a viewing app versus a writing stuff down app. So we could also look at, in addition, you saw I had two tasks for today. I have 82 over two data tasks. I have 77 due. Um, coming up soon. And I have, if we go back here so we can see these are all my tasks, uh, I have 857 that I haven't set due dates for. Um, if we jump over here to that little finger, it looks like I can add myself a little note. Remember to buy ice cream. Because obviously that's very important. So we'll say done. And now that's in there as a little note reminder, um, remember to buy ice cream. So this is interesting, when I put little notes in there, I can mark this as complete and it will check it off. Um, if I go over here to Pretty Fabulous, this tells me what workspace I'm in. As you know, I'm a solopreneur, I just have one workspace, I don't work on a team or anything else. So there are no other workspaces for me to go into. Um, but over here for, this is the only area where you can actually add anything. Um, I don't think you can add a task. Uh, let's see, you don't have the ability to add tasks. So I still like it. It's probably going to give me notifications now that I've enabled it on my Apple Watch, but you can quickly look at your um, your tasks and I believe you can see, you can just see the name of the task. It looks like, I don't even know, I don't think I put details in here. So, um, oh, you can see the due date but you can just see it, you can't actually change it. And then you can add little reminders for yourself and you can check them as being done. Uh, we'll give ourselves a smiley face as something to do, yep, something to do, smile. And we can mark that as complete and then it will just magically disappear. So that is the ClickUp app on your Apple Watch. So I hope that was helpful and I hope you're excited about using that on your watch as well.